Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the transmission spring on your lawnmower, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting and close the fuel valve. We recommend performing this procedure with little or no fuel in the tank. Now carefully tip the mower on its side with the fuel tank facing up. Use a 10 millimeter socket and wrench to unthread the bolts securing the shroud. Note that some of the bolts are threaded into retaining nuts. You will need to lift and secure the deflector to access the bolts in the rear. The upper rear bolt requires a T40 Torx bit to remove. With the bolts removed, detach the shroud. Next, use pliers to detach the clutch cable from the bracket and unhook the cable from the transmission. If still intact, detach the old transmission spring from the bracket and the transmission. Install the new spring by attaching one end to the transmission and the other end to the bracket. Hook the clutch cable on the transmission and secure it in the bracket. Reposition the shroud, making sure the shutter door pin snaps into it. Replace all of the bolts and retaining nuts, if applicable, to secure the shroud. Release the rear deflector. Return the mower to its upright position. With the repair completed, reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug. Open the fuel valve, refill the fuel tank, and your lawnmower should be ready for use.